Hello guys, welcome back. So in this video, we are going to cover the various internship opportunities for freshers as well as the pursuing people. So when we come to the internship, we are going to discuss the various internship opportunities in this video. That is web development internship and full stack development internship as well as Python and Java internship. Python, artificial intelligence, machine learning, data science as well as web development internship. And also we are going to discuss the cloud cyber security internship. So all these internships are from government only. When we open the official web page called National Internship Portal, as we can see, which is also sponsored by ACT as well as Ministry of Education here. When we go to the first internship, Web Development Internship Program by Skill Savvy Intern. So it is a virtual internship, complete online internship. The date posted was 28th January 2025. In multiple locations, you are going to have this internship here. We can start immediately. The duration is two months. They are not going to provide any stipend here. And the last date to apply is 30th January 2025. When we go to the description of that internship, as it is web development internship here, so you are going to work on real world projects where you will gain valuable hands on experience in both front end as well as the back end development. So you are going to get an experience on front end as well as back end development during this internship. And it is excellent opportunity for the developing as well as enhancing your skills while working on the various technologies like HTML, CSS, JavaScript and back end technologies like Node.js and databases. So they are not going to provide any stipend here, but once you complete the internship successfully, you are going to get the certificate here. So likewise, the, you can go through here and any branch of engineering or any branch of graduation, they can apply here like BE, BTEC, MBA, MCA and MSc or BCA, BSc like this. Any branch of students can apply here and specialization from any specialization they can apply here and the duration is two months here and relevant skills of number of openings are five year in the same manner. When we go for second internship here, full stack development using Flask here, which is offered by Switchsoft or OPC Private Limited here. This is also virtual internship, complete online internship. The date posted was 28 January 2025. In India, multiple locations we have. The duration is seven weeks of duration we have. And last date to apply is 28 February 2025. So when we go to the description of this internship here, we are going to get 45 days of virtual internship on full stack development using Flask and during this internship, you get hands on experience as well as the practical exposure to the end to end development process of web applications using the Flask. So, this internship is going to start from March 1st, 2025. So, you can apply on or before the deadline that is 20th February 2025. And after completion of this internship, student will get an internship completion certificate here. And the, any student from BE, BTEC, or Ecoland, like MSc or MCA or other branches, equal and branches, we can apply here. So from these branches, they can apply for this particular internship and duration is seven weeks here and you should have some relevant skills as well as interest. And these are the terms of uh, engagement here. You can go through this and the number of openings are 10 here. And when we go for third internship here, Python and Java full stack development uh, internship here, and this is also virtual internship and 28th January 2025, they posted here, multiple locations here, duration is three months and you can apply on or before 30th January 2025. So this internship is designed to provide the students with the chance to work live projects, allowing them to bridge the gap between theoretical as well as the practical application knowledge. And therefore, the internships are heavily focused on practical as well as the hands-on experience. And they are going to provide significant responsibilities for uh, the opportunity to contribute real projects here. So once you complete the internship successfully, they are going to receive an official offer letter along with the certificate of internship. Any branch of graduation or any branch from PG, they can apply here. There is no restrictions here. And terms of engagement, you can go through. Number of openings are three here. When we go for next internship here, Python AIML Data Science Website Development Internship here, Roboquick.com. This is going to offer this internship here. This is also a virtual internship. Date posted was today only. They posted 28th January 2025. So, uh, duration is six weeks here and apply by 31st January 2025. So in this internship, you are going to learn the various uh, uh, technologies like online course here. You can go through that course and you can apply for this internship if you are interested. But the basic criteria is we need to have a profile in national internship portal. So if you want to apply any one of these internships, we need to register in national internship portal. Anyway, if you have that, you can apply for this particular internship. And we need to have the phone number, mail address, as well as 12th percentage, college name, gender, etc. Otherwise, the applications are going to be rejected here. So after completion of this, you are going to get the completion certificate here. Any branch of graduation, any branch of PG, they can apply here. 
the duration is six weeks here and we should have some relevant skills here number of openings are three so whatever the internship we are going to apply if you want to apply that internship we need to apply through national internship portal only and the last internship we are going to have is google for cloud security Cl google for cloud cyber security virtual internship cohort 11 and the date posted was 20th january and immediately and we can apply by 31st of january 2025 here the minimum requirements are a little bit different from other the currently pursuing as you can see they're currently pursuing b btech me mtech mca diploma institutions which are the members of edu skills so only for this internship if your institute is member of edu skills then only you are eligible to apply otherwise you are not eligible to apply for this particular internship whereas other internships there is no restrictions like this and the flow process is two months eight weeks or two months or eight weeks and we need to part of the google developer here so that we can apply apart from that you also get the four days eight hours of mentoring sessions by industry experts here that is on each day you are going to get two hours of training from the industry experts apart from this internship anyone can apply here and the total number of openings we can see 10,000 a huge number of openings are there so if you apply early you may get the possibility of getting this internship here so whatever the internship you are going to apply if you want to apply that what we need to do we need to click on not a robot then click on apply now so when we click on apply now it will ask you to log in here if you already registered no problem otherwise you can register here or simply you can log in so once you click on the login it will ask you whether you are a student or the university so i am saying you can see here the complete dashboard we can see number of internships applied shortlisted interview calls and see complete details here so this is the login credentials of uh, the first year btech student that particular student is in first year till now the, he applied two internships here one is machine learning with python internship that is on 26 9 2029 like this we can apply and if you got if you select the internship also you can track the status from this uh, internship portal which is a ASCT internship portal here so if you have any queries simply comment on me so that i'll try to reply so before uh, concluding this you need to apply the maximum number of internships so that you can have the maximum possibility for selecting any one of the internships so don't apply for one or two apply in maximum so that your uh, uh, probability is going to be increased here so thank you all the best